welcome back to another video and I am excited because this is another review as you can tell by the title um but yes I'm so excited because I have not done a review video in forever but here we are so as you can see by the title we're going to be reviewing texture ID the dry hair and scalp relief line which I'm excited about um and this is going to be a two-part video series yeah so anyway the first part is going to be trying the texture id dry hair and scalp relief line and the other one's going to be about the texture id curls line um i saw these a few months ago was it a few months ago i would say like a month or two ago i saw it in sally's and i didn't even know that they had this at all because one Texture ID has not been on their Instagram in so long, so I have not been getting any updates. But yeah, so when I went to Sally's, I was completely surprised when I saw that they had two new lines and they had another coils line. Like I said, I, yeah. But anyway, here we are. I'm so excited because this first part is going to be the dry hair and scalp relief. And they have an exfoliating shampoo. Um, They have a hair mask, they have a soothing oil, and they have a soothing scalp mist. So these are the four items that I'm going to be trying in the first video. And of course, like I said, in the second video, we're going to be highlighting um, the curls line from Texture ID. So yeah. Okay, so first we're going in with an exfoliating shampoo scalp scrub. This is infused with eucalyptus. It says this shampoo gently exfoliates loosening impurity and buildup on hair and scalp and it also has aloe as well as cocoa butter. So this shampoo is supposed to help soothe itchiness caused by dryness. It's supposed to invigorate and refresh the hair and scalp with micro exfoliating crystals. So we are going to gently massage the scalp to help loosen dirt and impurities for a deeper cleansing. I've already detangled my hair in the shower prior to putting the shampoo in my hair. And the texture of the shampoo really reminds me of a conditioner. It does not lather. It's very, very moisturizing. Um, the shampoo is giving me a cleansing feeling as I massage it on my hair and scalp. But it's very refreshing because it has like eucalyptus in it, as I said before. So like the best way to describe it is like it's a Hall's Mint, but not as potent. So again, I'm just going to work this all around section by section. But I really like the shampoo because it's moisturizing and it's hydrating my curls. And like, as you can see, my curl definition with this shampoo is very prominent. So after rinsing out my shampoo, I'm going to go in with the dry hair and scalp relief soothing hair mask. So this mask deeply moisturizes and strengthens as well as repairs the hair. It says the mask is rich with avocado oil, which is one of my favorites, and cocoa butter. And this helps repair and condition while the powerful antioxidants nourish and strengthen dry damaged hair to provide intense moisture, helping promote all around help for your hair and scalp. The texture of this conditioner is very creamy. It's not too thick, but it's really light, like a light consistency, which I like. It's melting into my hair quite nicely, so it has great slip, which is always good, and it's producing a lot of moisture. And the eucalyptus is really soothing my scalp. It has way more potent feeling than it does with the shampoo. So I'm really liking how it's defining my hair, and the shampoo and conditioner pairs really well together to give you a great result. So with this conditioner, you have the option to use it daily as well as weekly. And if you use it daily, you can um, keep it in your hair to two to three minutes and then rinse it out with warm water following up with cool water. But I'm not going to do that. So when I use it, I'm more than likely only going to use it once a week. So while doing that, you have to leave it in your hair for seven to ten minutes. And that's what I'm going to do. So I'm just going to put my cap on, leave it to seven to ten minutes and then rinse it out. Okay, so I'm freshly out the shower and now I'm going to apply the Texture ID Dry Hair and Scalp Relief with Eucalyptus Soothing Scalp Mist. If it focuses, but yeah. So it comes in like this little packaging, really cute. So this um, scalp mist is with peppermint oil, aloe vera, 
and ginger. So it tells you to mist onto dry or wet hair and scalp and style as usual. So of course, now that I'm going into my styling portion, I'm going to spritz this all over my scalp and my sections. And then also I'm going to then apply the Texture ID Dry Hair and Scalp Relief with Eucalyptus Soothing Oil. There we go. I can see it a little bit better. But yes, and this oil is with Baobab Oil, Spearmint, Tea Tree Oil, and this replenishes moisture and soothes dry scalp. And for the directions, it says apply to scalp, hair, or skin. So you can use this on your skin as well. Um, and soften and soothe. Best if used within the six months of opening. So your best bet from what it says on directions is to use this within a six month span after opening um, the seal. And then I think that's it. Yeah. So here we go. <laughs> Okay, so I have applied both of these and yeah, so we won't really know the long-term effects until I use it on a regular basis, but I love it. It's a cooling, misting feeling. It feels really good, very light on the hair. Um, overall, based off those first two products, so overall, I freaking love this line. So I just call this the prepping stage um the wash the deep condition the treatments love it and this line right here was beautiful from this being a very moisturizing like shampoo not stripping the hair it felt like a conditioner and but cleaning and cleansing your hair at the same time it felt beautiful to my strands and then of course along with the dry hair and scalp relief hair mask again beautiful if you have not gotten this i i say go get it it feels great and my hair feels really clean it feels good and then all on top of that my scalp feels like a hall's mint so yeah give this a try and guys also stay tuned for the styling portion